In Creo Parametric 8.0, the transparency control workflow in interface has been improved based on feedback received from our users. No longer only available in the View tab, you can now access the transparency control from the In Graphics toolbar. The prior BREP filter has been separated into their own filters, one for solid bodies and one for quilts. This will allow you better control on enabling transparency on your desired geometry. For components or solid bodies, you can easily select them in the graphics window and through the mini toolbar make them transparent. You can select them again through the same process to turn off the transparency. Once set as transparent, you'll be able to control the transparency value and display through the transparency control settings. Having set a few components as transparent, you can easily change the value of transparency from the default 50% to let's say 75, or simply use the corresponding slider. The display updates immediately. You can now toggle the transparency on and off to see it update on the screen. For surfaces, quilts, and tessellated geometry, the transparency is immediately controlled by the transparency control settings. By default, the transparency is set to a value of zero. However, you can adjust that to see the corresponding geometry update. This enhancement will allow you to quickly control the transparency display of different components or types of geometry without having to set a defined appearance or appearance state. It will provide you an improved user experience when working with different geometry representation types.